Do you need a countdown timer for your stream? There's a lot of different ways of doing this, but I want to show you a nice easy way of doing this via our friend, the facilitator, Saeed Saduk himself. You can head over to his website, thefacilitator.com, and if you head over to the free resources, it's an OBS countdown timer. Click on that one and we're presented with our timer. We've got our options here. We can adjust the time. So I'm going to make this zero minutes and 30 seconds. We've got a number of different styles that we can choose from. Sans Serif Solid, Comic Angled Solid, Sketch 3D, Circle Style, and Heart Style. I think I'm going to probably stick with the Sans Serif today. We've got a number of different colors here, Pitch Black, uh, Scarlet Red, for example. But I think for my purposes, I'm going to go with Snow White. And finally, we've got an, an, an end animation option here. So you can either leave this as none or you can choose the fade out option. So once we've done that, if we click on this copy timer link, that link will be copied to our clipboard. Now, if we head over to OBS, um, I have done a version of this previously, so I'm just gonna delete this and get rid of it. But what you'll wanna do in OBS, and this works in Ecamm and anything that really supports a browser source, go down and add in a new source, go to browser, we can give this a name. I'm just going to call this one countdown and I'm going to hit enter or click OK. And I just want to cop, uh, paste in that URL that we got from that website. I'm going to change the dimensions of this to 1920 by 1080 just to match everything else. The other thing I will do is if I scroll down, we've got a couple of options here. I find I get the best results when I use both of these. So shut down source when not visible. I'm going to turn that one on and refresh browser when the source becomes active. And now if I click OK, we will see that pop up and it will count down and do its thing. The great thing about this is if I toggle the visibility off and then I toggle it back on, it'll start from that 30 point. And of course, we can grab the, the corners. We can make this uh, larger or smaller. If I want to crop that or rearrange where I want that to be, I can certainly do that. So. If you need a countdown timer, like I said, it might be a good idea to check out thefacilitator.com. Don't forget to follow Saeed on YouTube as well.